Hello, people. I think you remember my other video about, you know, the Modern Warfare 3 thing. You know, again, if you are a Call of Duty person, you may not want to watch this video. Like, I know that's my third time repeating that, but, you know, in just case. Now, this is Battlefield 3. I'm going to show you how awesome Battlefield 3 is, and it's way better than Call of Duty, believe it or not. Now, I'm going to start it. In the beginning of Battle Modern Warfare 3, it shows all the, you know, stuff and all that, and goes really, really slow. Battlefield 3, they do a simple, easy, and fast. Like this. These are, this game is actually based on real marines, which this other marine actually killed his... I don't know. I didn't really finish the campaign. Don't laugh. Sorry. Yeah. And, um... Well, actually, you can't laugh. And, you know, no game could ever do that. Maybe in the future, but... This is the first game I've ever seen doing something that shocking. Believe it or not, that's actually why I do one reason is why I like this game. And we look really closely. Wait, give it a minute. The only bad thing about this game, it loads really, really slow. Sometimes. Yeah, sometimes. <sighs> give it a minute. Do, 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 do. My end of my soul area, you can view multiplayer and stats body. That's cool. But again, Battlefield 3 did it nice and simple, you know. Okay, if you look really closely in the background, you can see the background kind of moving. Not the vehicles or anything, just these orange lines, I think they are. And of course, premium. I think a lot of people already have that. I wish I did, but I don't want it right now. And, you know, how they show you how to create your class in, you know, Modern Warfare 3, they do it a little bit different. Like they did in the gamer tag, I believe. The I forgot what it was. They did the whole rectangle thing, and here they do a dog tag, which Marines actually do use in real life. And these people, I think they use actual Marine faces in this. And except for that one, I don't know for sure. I think that's what Scouter really looks like. But all these faces are real and all the guns and the only gun they don't have so far is M416 and Modern Warfare 3 and of course tanks and helicopters okay now we're done with that co-op same as you know survival but you know just a little bit different as you should say okay now going on to the multiplayer yes server browser later boards from a server server and my servers and mattress. I only have one server, but it already expired. Okay. You know, they made it simple and easy, but I invited a friend right there. Ignore that sign right there. Okay, now, in Modern Warfare 3, you can't really choose your favorite game. You can only choose your favorite game mode. In this one, you can choose your favorite map, which is, for me, Gulf of Omen, Operation Firestorm, or Caspian Border. The reason why is because they have a lot of space. That map has a lot of space. Those maps, you know. So let's go on. Yeah, let's go on the Gulf of Oman. You know? And another thing about Modern Warfare 3, they have a time limit. Battlefield 3, they have no time limit whatsoever. And, you know, Battlefield 3, you can rent your own server, make it any way you want it, put your own rules, and all of that. In Modern Warfare 3, you cannot do that whatsoever. Believe me, I've tried. And that means don't really try it, but, you know. And even if you look on the bottom, you could put yourself in a squad, or you don't have to. To me, I like being in a squad, that's why I get to spawn on somewhere whenever I don't feel like spawning at flags. Like I say, you can fly jets and everything. This is actually an F-35. These are actual real jets. They use them in real life. P.S. I am not a good jet flyer. The only thing I have a lot is heat seekers and flares. Flares, see? So, I'm gonna jump off right here, cause, you know, I don't feel safe. 
If you guys play Capture the Flag on Mono for 3, this is kind of the same. Wow, that scared the heck out of me. It's kind of the same, but different. You know, you get to, you know, do other things. Also, you can steal other dog tags. If you guys knifed in Modern Warfare 3, it just, you know, shank dead. And this one is a little bit different. Oh, this one. Oh, it's too late. If I could find a guy to knife in this one, I would show you something really cool. If I could find someone to knife. But first, let's go after the flags. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Don't give away my spot. Don't give away my spot. Don't give away my spot. Easy. Watch. Oh, come on. See, he gave away my spot, which sucks. This man. Oh, man. Sorry about this, people. This is actually, you know... I would ask you guys if that's perfect or not. Oh man. If you guys have last stand in Modern Warfare 3 and you know, you can revive the players and everything. This one, even if they don't you don't even need a perk in this one. You have all the perks you need in one game. Ah, yeah. And this game is one of the best realistic games in I think this year or something like that. I think it's this century. I don't know. It's somewhere around there. Also, I only have four minutes left. Man, I want to knife someone for you guys, but I don't know where to find someone to knife. Oh, yeah, I want to show you guys something about the knife. In Modern Warfare 3, you have to, you know, have a gun, get it ranked up, and get a knife. In this one, you don't even have to rank up for anything to get a knife. You just have to do this. Wait, give me a minute. I get somewhere where I can, you know, just drop down. Give me a minute. Right there. Okay. Watch this. And the parry shooting in this game is actually really cool. Parry shooting is one of my favorite things in this game. Watch this. See? Now I want to show you guys the knife in this game. Are you serious? Yeah. But you don't even have to rank up or anything. You just automatically grab a, grab a knife by pressing RB. Actually holding it. Pressing it will just, you know, go like that. But it's actually really cool. And let's see if I can knife this guy. Watch this. Oh, what? I knifed him in a different way, which really doesn't make any sense. Okay, let's see if I can go find someone to knife real quick. I only have two minutes left. Find an enemy if you guys can. Yeah, yeah, I need an enemy here. Ow. Ow. Ow, that hurt. Okay, I need an enemy, not a tank. I know that for sure. Yeah, let's see. Let's see. Oh yeah, another thing. In Modern Warfare 3, you can't really do anything about, you know, changing, you know, like, yeah, full auto and, you know, three round burst and single burst. This one, you could change it just by being in the game. Watch. Right now I have a full auto. I change it right now. Oh wait, I'm about to go. Sorry. Ah. Sorry. I press this. I got it in single burst. And these are Battlefield 3, you will find Call of Duty noobs all over the place. Believe me. I found so many Call of Duty noobs this night were funny. Now let's see. Oh, actually, I think this might be the end of the video. I might make another one just to show you guys how to knife someone. Till then, it was nice, you know. Thank you for watching, all that other stuff. So, well, let me just revive this guy over here. Where's his body? Oh, how do you get up there? Whoa, okay, so it was nice knowing you guys, and I will pause this, and I will record it again after this. So thank you for watching and have a good day.